Look at the butter oozing out of that. Holy smokes! Hello everyone! <laughs> Welcome back to Food Review Club. I'm in Stoke Newington to do a review of a bagel shop. There behind me. It's called The Bagel House. And around that corner there, it's got a really nice uh, light up sign that says 24 hours. Can you answer me this please, if you're watching now? Why are all uh, bagel shops 24 hours? I think it's to do with like feeding the feeding the city after dark, taxi drivers. I bet they just cook them non-stop, don't they? So they're just probably open. That's Connor Ben. Who? Look, that's Connor, that's Connor Ben. I'm gonna tag him in this video. <laughs> See his number plate, it says KO Ben. Yeah, Connor Ben, there he is driving around. Big fan of your work, mate. <laughs> right, let's get on with the review. This video is brought to you by eTag Fixins. Down there is the logo, major sponsor of our page. If you're watching this now as a tradesman, using your hands for fixings, all that kind of jazz, go and check them out. Link to the website is in the comments below. They've also got tutorials, how-to style videos. Very good for the people of Food Review Club. Right, let's dive into this now. I got two donuts, two bagels, two drinks, 11 pounds. Bargain. I actually questioned her and said, you've added it up wrong. My bagel was £4.80. Look at me remembering the prices. Jesus. Jess, could I pass you, please, this, whilst we dive into the hot bagel. Of course I've got salt beef, mustard, pickles. And I'm excited. There's something about salt beef that we all love. Now, they do it all themselves here, but can I add as well, the lady that served me in there. I don't know where she's from, they're all like, I think they're like Italian, I'm not sure. They were lovely. Absolute vibe there, they're all working away. Smashing out the order for people. Look at this little queues formed here as well. <laughs> awesome. Here we go, look. Those of you watching around the world, yeah, do you reckon there's people watching this now from around the world? If you're watching this from uh, out of the UK shores, number one, give it a share, get into new territories. And B, let us know where you're from. Put us in the comments now. Those of you up north as well, put your towns and cities in. In your villages, you're you're basically um, overseas. Oh, what? That is a stacker. So I've got butter. She said, "Do you want butter, mustard, pickles?" Like, yep. See the butter oozing out of that. Holy smokes! Why did I not go for that now? now? Hello, mate. You can sell this for you. You've Say again. Seventy pounds. Yeah, I, I will. Let me film this review, and I'll sort you out. No problem. No problem, sir. There we go. That is absolutely stacked. So we've got pickles under there, look. See the pickles in there? Mustard on top. Oh, sorry. What happened? I went a bit close. Did you? I was in the bagel. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Let's, go. let's dive in. Oh my God, it smells so good. Salt beef. You haven't had salt beef for a while, have you? just amazing truly it's like I'm not a Londoner so maybe it's not in my blood the same for a lot of people watching this now but definitely hits the spot it's like one of those uh, soul warmer like proper food you know bagels are delicious that pickle Cut through the salt beef amazingly well. Mustard on top adds the warmth. Super salty beef. Look at it, look. These are absolute slabs of meat. Mm. It's like butter soft. Really delicious. Oh, well. Guys. Get in the comments and let me know where you think is the best salt beef bagel. <clears throat> in the lungs. <coughs> salt beef went into lung. <coughs> you want to see the first death on Food of Club ever. Yeah, let me know where the best salt beef is in the UK. The man's just dying, he wants another bite. 
Yeah. Mustard. On point. Now, you hold that thing, yeah? I got myself. I got myself something else. What's I kind of wanted to unwind and think about the score for that? Drink watch. <laughs> Robina. Feel like a little kid. Oh my god. Also, it's fucking freezing out here. Yeah, why are you wearing a t-shirt? Doing a, a cold, a bit of cold training at the moment. Shocking the body into trying to lose some weight. <laughs> lost, lost use of fingers right now. <laughs> trying to navigate my way through a straw is a tough grasp. A tough ask. My mouth's not working. Ribena. Hello, welcome and goodbye. Ooh. Pick it up, I promise. Now, this particular shop had an absolute array of pastries. Probably the, probably the entire counter was donuts, cakes, desserts, pastries, cannolis, little spinny things. <laughs> I don't know what they were. It looked good. So, <clears throat> she upsold me. She upsold me. The police in action. She upsold me this little donut. Oh. Handmade, homemade, their own donut. One for Jessica as well. Thank you. It's all right, my love. <laughs> um, I have to say something. So well, I was trying to communicate with you while you were in the shop. Yes. And you were mouthing things to me. But obviously I had a mask you on. had a mask on. So that is the downfall of yes. masks. Can't communicate yes. through glass. <laughs> so I was communicating back to you, but you couldn't see my mouth moving. <laughs> no. All right, let's um, let's start. Got yourself yeah. a wheel, mate. Yeah, mate. <laughs> I can do the rest of it. Go with me. You know, you need a need a bike for it. <laughs> Good old boy. So much hustle and the bustle going on right now. This is a cool part of London. Stoke Newington. We did best kebab, didn't we? Yes. Best kebab, Stoke Newington. I've got machines uh, cutting the donut. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Very good. Right, let's dive into this. Filled or not filled? No, it's a circular donut. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Properly banging. That caramel icing on top. Send bloody sensational. Right. Let's wrap this up. Salt beef bagel. Cracking. £4.80. Love the butter. The bagel was delicious. Probably most of all, it was stacked with meat. The pickle was lovely and the mustard worked perfectly. Something about a salt beef bagel, when they stack the meat in, makes everything better. Sometimes less is more in every other circumstance, unless you're eating salt beef. Then more is better. So, I want to give this today a score of, what, police everywhere. Sorry, we're opposite a police station. Opposite a police station. Yeah, police, have a day off for you. <laughs> It's only the salt beef bagel from here, like a really good eight out of 10. Oh. Eight out of 10, the donut on point. The drink, but run me a minute and child again. Yeah, that's it. So e-tag fixings, that's another review for you. They're a major sponsor of the page. Go and check them out, please, in the comments. We can't do it without them. Thanks for watching everyone. That was another salt beef bagel review in London. Where else must we go to try the salt beef. Big debate. Thanks for watching everyone. That was a review.